and uh, slowly his health faded and then he went away. Yeah. Yeah. He never said to me, I'm going to die. But I knew. So I, I'd write him letters. You know, I wanted to stay, and his brother said to me, mm -hmm. you can't, you have to go, because if you stay, he'll know that you know something's really wrong. And it was very hard to accept. And it was at a time when AIDS was just, ha they didn't talk about it. Mm -hmm. It was something to be ashamed of, which is really? ludicrous, yeah. you know. But that's the way it was, and those are the facts. He went to San Francisco, and he got himself a Rolls Royce, and he would be in the car, and he would drive around on his own. And he was not taking calls from anybody. He was by himself. God, I, I, when he died, I, I went nuts. Really, I went into such a depression. Well, I didn't think, I, I, I knew other people would die because they were getting old. But Halston, no. It's very hard to say goodbye when you're not allowed to, you know? Fashion designer Halston, who created the pillbox hat worn by Jacqueline Kennedy at her husband's presidential inauguration, died last night in the San Francisco hospital.